Okay, hi guys, it's Spartan765. Um, today I'm doing a video uh, on uh, somebody told me to make a combat loadout. Hang on, whoops. First, if I ever go into combat, killing some zombies and stuff. So today I'm going to do my zombie combat killing loadout. Now, the number one issue with killing zombies is you never have too many firearms, okay? See, I got, I got, got a little bit here on here. Now these are the zombie killing combat loadout here. I got two most of the guns, the bayonet, mouth of the bayonet, Evo M56 966 with grenade launcher and bayonet. Got a G3 and about 3,000 rounds of ammo on my person. Uh, I forgot to put my shotgun in the loadout. I'll have to figure out where to put that next time. But I got an SKS down there in the belt loop. Got my tugger off sidearm right there. Uh, G3, a bunch of ammo. Got roughly. 400 rounds of ammo per rifle. Well, I got the most for the G3. But, um, oh well, yeah. It does cut off the circulation a little bit to your head, but you get used to that after a while. Okay. So, I mean, if you're gonna kill zombies, you're gonna need a loadout. On the back there in that pistol looking poster, that's a 26.5 millimeter incendiary launcher. So you can burn them fuckers out if you need to. Okay. Now, you know you're going to be killing zombies. You need a two or three hundred. You need about a two hundred pound loadout. Oh, you're not going to be very successful in killing the zombies. Okay. Now, let's say you run out of ammo on this here. Okay, you run out of ammo on your G3. You've used up your four hundred rounds, killing zombies. Okay, and then reach down here. Huh? And just pull out this cast right here, and you're ready to go. Okay. Killed all uh, uh, extended stock two for maximum accuracy. Okay, now listen here. Once you've used up your 330 rounds, 220 rounds, and you're out of ammo on your SKS, oh, see, then you're not screwed, you're not gonna die yet. Then you grab your, uh, your, uh, shit, it's stuck on something. Uh, you grab your Yugoslavian. M5966 SKS fed by stripper clips. By the way, I got uh, 20 of these on my person for this rifle. Just pull their back, load them stripper clips in there. Now, let's say you got a bunch of the zombies, about 20, 20, 30 of them. Yeah, that's what you bring a grenade launcher for. You stick that bitch on there right there like that. Oh, shit, bitch, get on there. Put a blank round in, flip her up, and you're ready to kick some ass. Okay? Once you run out of ammo on that rifle, sorry if I sound a little hoarse. Uh, I might have stroke soon. My my blood clot's getting cut out. Oh, here's some more mags. Okay, and you whip out your doesn't get stuck in something there. Your most in the gun, 9130. You're ready to kick them zombie bastards. Get them from long range with the bayonet too. Got about two meters there. Oof. Not really, not quite two meters, but you can get her done. Okay? Oh, you run out of ammo. By the way, I got about 150 rounds each for each each of these bolt action rifles here. You know, about 200 each. Once you run out of ammo on your most in the gun, 9130, you reach back there and you get your. Oh, it's stuck on something. You reach back there and you get your most in the gun dragoon. Converted 9130. You get that done, kill all them bastard zombies with that, you run out of ammo on that. <clears throat> oh shit. You reach back there and you grab your uh, bitch. Piece of shit. You grab your Yugoslavian Mauser, 8mm. Spike blade bayonet, also can be used to combat knife. But I prefer the bayonet. Get her down in there. Fuck up them zombie bastards, quite frankly. I mean, you gotta have ammo and guns if you're going up against the zombie bastards. Okay? Now, when you completely run out of ammo on that, let's say you got, there's a propane tank over there, you know, you got some zombies. About 180 of them. You really need to kill them? Well, then you switch over here. Yeah. There. It's your 26.5 millimeter incendiary cartridge launcher. 
shoot at that damn propane tank like a small nuclear bomb. It'll go right off and kill them zombie bastards. Carry about five of cartridges for that. Last but not least, or no, not second to last, but not least, when you run out of everything, pull out your sidearm there. That bastard's going to be dead. This is a 7.62 by 25 toke. Tokerov, you can kill pretty much anything with that, or zombies anyway. This magazine is loaded, but keep in mind the safety's on and there's no bullets in the firearm whatsoever. Okay? See? A little bit of gun safety there. Okay. Now there are two magazines in here more for it. Total of uh, 8, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 20, 24 rounds. And when you run out of all the ammo on that, then you whip out your combat knife here. Get them zombie bastards where they stand. Okay, when you run out of that, and you really know you're going to be screwed, think of Left 4 Dead 2. What's the newest thing in Left 4 Dead 2? Melee weapons, right? Well, the knife doesn't really count as a melee weapon, so I had to be a little creative. Let me open this damn pouch here. Okay. Then you whip out your bastard won't come out. Your German entrenching shovel. Now this here is 1.5 millimeter thick steel. I mean, you could really just pfft, with that thing right there, and this will get you done going all day. You know, just them zombies won't last long with that shit. You know, then when you break that, well, all the zombies would probably be dead after you broke that. Um, that's my review. You're done. Okay.